This is a shocking development. I think we always feared after the first execution and having seen another person in those videos that this would happen to someone else. But I think that this represents a hardening of the attitude of IS and it must be causing huge concern in the United States of America and indeed amongst her friends, including Great Britain, as we try to grapple with the security issues around this repugnant and evil group that seems to be hell-bent on killing people in this way. And that is why what we need to do is build on what the Prime Minister said yesterday with the security measures that he announced to the House of Commons. But more than that, this cannot just be done by the Americans. There are connections of ISIS in other parts of the world. And that is why the committee has suggested uh, a while ago that we should build a platform between those countries that allow their citizens to go and fight in these places, Britain, France, Germany and others, so that together we can try and fight this dreadful organisation. But for the relatives, the friends of those journalists who've been executed in this way, this must be an absolutely terrible day. And of course, we will want to make sure that our reaction is proportionate, but that we prevent this happening again.